you hurt me. And you didn't know because you weren't there last night as I was weeping. You didn't see me with my blanket over my face as if I was sleeping to hide the pain from plain view and sight. I cried last night. I wish we could be on the same page and this was the same game that we played and it was all a dream, but you hurt me. And maybe I hurt you too, but I haven't the slightest clue because you weren't there to show me the tears I imagined you had if I hurt you so bad and I'm sorry, but you hurt me. And you weren't there to pick up the pieces. I had to leave this on the corner of my pillowcase. I had to be the strong suit in an empty place. I had to show strength in a broken place and it hurts because you hurt me. And this isn't even a poem, it's my pain that just so happens to rhyme. This is not a finger snapping event, not this time, because you hurt me. And it's been many days where I've applauded an artist's pain, but I didn't know that it hurt so bad until you hurt me. Dear poets of expressions, I've just learned a lesson. You take your tears and ball them up into words for people to enjoy and listen as they snap as you deploy your parachute of emotion as you dive into this ocean of entertainment. I'm sorry for knowing that I smiled at your pain and your talent was my game, but I had no idea until you hurt me. I cried last night and you weren't there to dry my tears or even hear why I was weeping when I should have been sleeping because you left me as I cried, as I died to poetry of my own heart, but never again will I cry for this as no tear is the same, and I will pick myself up from this one day as soon as I get the chance and opportunity to tell you what you did to me, to tell you what you made in me, and I just can't believe it. You were supposed to love me like you said you did, but you hurt me.
I laid out my colors for you. I even showed you the colors that the colors you saw were mixed with to make up the colors in me, but you ignorantly chose the cutie that you could take home to mommy because she seemed like wifey material. What do you think? She was made with that cheap fabric. And that was something like 100% cotton. <clears throat> Silly you, you passed up the real woman that admitted to you that what you were in for because every relationship had its problems, but you chose the one that promised none instead of me that promised some, but with honesty and a fight in me to make it worth being a thing, but you're too late. I don't want you now. <laughs> <laughs>